Hello and welcome to HD Calcs. I'm Rick and in this video we're going to have a look at what is and how can we use the constant or K function on the Texas Instruments TI-30X2S calculator. To do this we'll use the second function key that looks like this located here and the division key with the second function of K or constant that looks like this located here. What the k function does is allow us to enter a function that will be automatically applied to the end of whatever we have on our screen. We can access it by pressing the second division key. There we go. And that brings us to this, k equals, where we can enter our constant. Let's take a look at how we can use this. We can use it to determine the price of various ticket packages. Let's say we wanted to go to a show and one ticket costs three dollars and seventy-five cents and we want to know how much different ticket packages cost. Well we can use the constant function for this. So we go to second division, there's our k, and for this we'll set our function to times 3.75 which is the price of our tickets. So times 3.75 and you want to make sure to always have an operator which is a plus minus division multiplication at the start because this will be applied to the end of whatever we enter on our screen. So there we go k equals times 3.75 and then we press enter and see a k appear down at the bottom of our screen. That means our constant is active. Now we can clear out of this, see the K remains, and now to see how much the ticket packages cost for say five tickets, we just press five and then we can press equals and our K is automatically applied there. So five times 3.75 equals 18.75. So our five tickets cost $18.75. Oh, but looks like some more people want to go. Now we need to get 17 tickets. Again, all we have to do is enter the 17, press equals, and that times 3.75 is automatically applied. So we see our 17 tickets now cost $63.75. But what if we want to buy both packages of tickets? Well, what we can do is put on our screen in brackets 5 plus 17 and close our brackets. We need to use brackets because remember our constant is just applied at the very end of whatever we put here. And press equals and see we get our 5 plus 17 and then times 3.75 so if we get both packages it costs $82.50. If we're done using our constant and want it to stop being applied, we can turn it off by pressing the second function key and then the division key again. And the K should now disappear from the bottom of our screen. And now when we hit something like say five, our constant is no longer applied. All right, I hope this helps and good luck on those tests out there everybody.